You are live. So I'm going to wait here for a couple of moments quietly. Can I wait quietly? Okay, so I can't wait quietly. We just figured that out. I can. I'm going to wait for another couple of minutes. It's Tuesday. And it's a good day. And so I'm going to tell you my schedule real fast for my blogs. I will be blogging, um, writing an article on Tuesdays or posting an article, a different article on Tuesdays and on Thursdays and on Saturdays. So I'm truly going to try to be more consistent about my blogging. You know, it's not my most favorite thing to do. Um, and it's because I like to write. So, and then those of you who know me know that I'm like, right. And period. <laughs> and, um, you can't do that with blogs because they just are too long. So if you kind of saw my first ones, they were that more teachy, right. And so I'm learning, um, how to blog and make them short, concise to the point. So. This being said, I'm supposed to keep these things under three minutes. So let me go. I'm here to tell you about the blog that I'm releasing today. And so the blog today is whew, um, that right there. Name of it is Grief, and it's How Long is Too Long. And so today is 20 years that Michelle's body, right, was laid to rest. June 7th was 20 years that she has been passed over to the other side. And people are always asking me, right, at my book signings and for sharing the way to grief or, you know, when I some, meet someone in the grocery store or, you know, even people that are my close circles, right? How long is too long? How long, how much is enough? When does grief stop, right? Um, so the article speaks on that today. So have a blessed day. Remember, if you're going through grief or if it seems, if you're just getting there on the journey or if you've been on the journey for a while like me or longer than me, remember, right, that grief is better shared. So find someone today to talk to about it, right? Breathe. And know this too shall pass. Mwah. Happy Tuesday. Bye-bye.